Hear the sound. Title cut on the new CD. Now, Sean, your dream was to lead a Christian band, to sing in a Christian band, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. And, and you were so intent on that that you were heading for Nashville. Yeah, you know, I, I mean, I, I uh, just always just saw myself as a, as a guitar player, and, and it wasn't until... Uh, until I went to uh, to Teen Mania when I when I met uh, Paul Balash that that just this this calling in worship seemed to uh, seemed to to unfold and and uh, you know God used Paul in just you know amazing ways in, in my life to just pour into me and and uh, you know just basically you saw something in me that I didn't really see at the time and so um, after that you know I just I, God started opening doors for for me to lead worship and. Wonderful. Now there might be someone watching who doesn't know the name, Paul Balash, but I'll bet they sing Paul Balash. Mm. What songs do we know? Yeah, I mean, um, "Open the Eyes of My Heart," mm -hmm. um, "Above All," uh, "Your Name." You know, some of the more recent ones. But yeah, yeah, he's he's uh, he's written just just amazing songs for the church, and 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 to you know to have somebody like that mentoring me was just unbelievable for me. I'm not sure if we picked it up here, but you did have to lay the dream down. Hmm. And wait for God, didn't you? Yeah, I mean, it's it's uh, it's 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 basically just kind of going along with with the journey and the doors that God opens and closes, and and uh, you know, up until this point, I you know we've had a, a couple other CDs, but it feels like just now, you know, it's it's been about a ten year journey. Mm -hmm. um, you know, we're we're feeling like you know, this is this is a time that that God has us in and, and so it's just yeah, it's just going going with where you know we feel God is leading us and sometimes it's in you know music ministry sometimes it's you know other things but but yeah just and worth the wait where was this done and who helped <laughs> that was uh, it, it was recorded in Nashville with um, producer uh, Brent Milligan and um, it was just such an honor to work with a guy like Brent he's uh, he he's worked with uh, or he just produced Stephen Curtis Chapman's latest album and and he's worked with David Crowder Band and and uh, and some other, you know, well-known Christian artists out there. And and for us just to have the opportunity to work with him was just That's unbelievable. It was such an honor. And, and this is just a sidebar, but Amy, you were telling me when I was up there that uh, you've stumbled onto a rather amazing mentor for your spiritual journey. Mm. Um, yeah, I mean, I, it's it's kind of been a journey for both of us to go through in regards to um, working together. And we've stumbled across Brian Dirksen as well. And I think mm -hmm. maybe what you're referencing to is Shannon, Shannon Etheridge. Shannon Etheridge, who's been here many yeah, times. Yeah, and that was actually through, that's through my sister-in-law, yeah. Emma. Um, oh, it's she Emma has, who yes, that gets a close, right. Yeah, very that's close right. See, they're all so connected. <laughs> that's right. What, what you're getting here is a picture of a church mm, up in North Bay that is absolutely <laughs> loaded with young, dynamic, leadership being mentored mm. by some of the best mm. it's just thrilling now you're taking this on the road which is a surprise yeah we uh, we uh, we basically just decided to take four months off from March to June just to uh, just to travel across the country and we uh, we we sent out this big mass email to just you know several you know churches hundred churches in uh, in Canada and we heard back from from a lot of them and so we uh, we just started um, Got booking, about booking these dates. Yeah, we have about sixty yeah, dates um, booked. So yeah. You know what I love about the the origin of this whole wonderful journey is that a, a neighbor and friend shared Christ with you, mm. and it was after that that 
a friend, different friend, shared with your parents? Yeah, yeah, it was, uh, yeah, it was pretty amazing just the timing. You know, I was, I was, you know, around eight or nine at mm -hmm. the time, and and uh, yeah, he was just a great friend, a neighbor, and uh, and um, yeah, he he just prayed with me one. Uh, one day during recess at, at school. <laughs> and, um, you know, my parents weren't saved at the time, but it was right around that time that, that God was kind of doing something in their lives through another um, uh, friend of the family. Mm -hmm. And uh, and so it was neat. Yeah, just, you know, my parents got saved right around the same time. And, and they're, you know, just amazingly supportive. They're actually going to be uh, touring with us in our, in our motor okay. homes. So.